think we could do this better. I had initially finished making the water pieces and I was really happy with how they turned out. The problem that I have is I plan on giving these files away to my patrons and though I don't need them to interlock, other people might. So I went back to the drawing board and redid all of these water pieces and came up with something a little bit different. I now have a pattern that is continuous across the entire thing. So when you do lay it down, it looks like one big water picture rather than the same image portrayed six different times.
So I got all the glossy coats applied to all the tan tiles. What I'm doing now is putting them all on magnet sheets because the plan is to put this on a magnet board so we can have it as an art piece on the wall. The first one of these tiles that I did, I put a tape barrier in the center, mainly because I did not know if the surface tension technique of flooding these would work. I was pretty confident that it would stay on the sides. I wasn't sure entirely how this was going to work, but it seemed to work a lot easier to just flood them entirely rather than to do this, because now what I have to do is go back and sand this, and then just do a clear coat of resin on top of it to try to salvage this piece and not need to remake it entirely. Now let's try to fix this guy. We're going to be mounting the Catan tiles to an actual board because we're going to hang it on the wall long term. What I need to do right now is trace around the water to get the shape of the board we need and cut down this board so I can start gluing the metal sheet as well as the water pieces down. So on the sheet I have marked off the entire grid itself, but I also made these lines here to be where I'm going to be cutting the metal sheet. So when we attach this to the board, I'm only going to have this inner hex that's going to get glued down, so this is going to be the magnet for all the pieces. So I got all of these little magnets that I put inside of all of the pieces. They are adhesive backed magnets and I put a bead of super glue around them because all the pieces have little metal circles attached to them. So this way when it's hanging up on the wall it's not going to fall out. So let's assemble this and then I guess be done with it.